Hi, I'm Adam Pitti, Olympic champion and world record holder, and this is my training routine to become stronger and faster in the pool. So squats is extremely important to build my breaststroke power. Most of that power is 70% of the whole stroke. Obviously, we need a very, very powerful leg kick. Builds the muscle in the quadriceps, glutes, lower back and hamstrings. I normally do around five reps of three sets, three or four sets, depending on what time of year we're on. I normally around 130K, but it can be anywhere from 90 kilograms to 150 kilograms. When squatting, keep your feet parallel and your knees and feet in line with your shoulders. Bench press is very important for me as it's an extra 30% on my stroke. It's where I catch most of the water, where most of my technique settles um, and it enables me to build power and strength from my chest. So with bench press, I normally use a barbell. I also use a football bar um, where my hands are a little bit inverted just to kind of save me from injury. I normally average around 120, 125 kilograms for about five three sets of that. Chin-ups is a great all-rounder, builds my back muscles, my triceps, my biceps and my forearm muscles. They kind of replicate the motion that I do in the pull-down. We normally do it with weight just because, you know, when I'm kind of going up there, I'm going only for five reps. I don't want to be doing you know, 20 reps where I'm going to fatigue myself so much that I can't do another exercise. I want to be doing it so I can build my power and strength effectively. Clap press-ups are very beneficial to what I do just because it enables me to get as much power and strength out of the, the push-up as possible. On a push-up you want to be staying quite lateral so you want, to, you, know, you want to be able to put a stick from your head to your toes and no bends in there. And then what you want to be doing is pushing as much power out of the floor as you can. With my core, I like to call this extended crunch. It helps me enable that power and strength through my arms and through my legs in the water. If you don't have a good core, you're going to start sinking and it's going to be a lot harder to start kicking and, and pulling. I like to go around 20 reps, so this is a little bit higher than the rest of them, um, but I like to go for three or four sets of that, as well as supersetting in between with another core exercise. To fuel this routine, pre-workout, I have Science and Sport BCA Perform and Hydro Tablets, and then post, I finish it off with a Protein 20 or Advanced Isolate.